here today with the lovely Bo Matthews and we're just going to ask her a few style questions after we've just made the baby's wardrobe look so dreamy. I know, it looks You're so, so cute. Excited. And I've kept my wardrobe the way you girls did the last time. Yeah. And that was months ago. That's and what I've, we like to hear. I've tried to recreate what you did in it in my wardrobe in Dublin. It doesn't look as good. I'm sure. Yeah. Yeah. sure it gave you some inspo. <laughs> okay, so over to the questions. So question number one is, what is your favourite item in your wardrobe? Favourite item? Do you know what? I'm going to go up my nether trousers and I wear them all the time. Nether trousers are expensive. You spend like 500 euro, at least 500 yeah. pounds, 500 euro on them. But I've had a pair from Australia and I've had them honestly for about six or seven years. Yeah, good investment. Such yeah. a good investment. And they last forever and yeah. they just go with everything. Yeah, yes. definitely a good answer. And the most expensive bag in your The most expensive, ooh. Probably a handbag. Yeah. I can't even think of which one. And a, a Mark Jacobs jacket I got that my yeah. friend fished out more the other day and I was like, oh, I don't <laughs> but know I think how definitely... I feel wearing that. <laughs> Bags are a good investment. Like bags yeah. and shoes, that might spend it. They last money on, forever. Exactly. I do have a good pair, like a, a good few good pairs of shoes. But you know what? I actually prefer throwaway shoes, really, yeah. because like styles change so much and everything. I have so many pairs of high street shoes, and then if you're wearing them out, you're going with a tear, yeah. not in a sash. <laughs> <laughs> I've just learned what that is. Yeah. <laughs> uh, if you're going out in a night out, I think that like your shoes get wrecked. Yeah, they're really really wearing really expensive. But I do have those good shoes as well. Yeah. <laughs> what item of clothing do you wear the most? Do I wear the most? Currently, any floaty dress I have. Yeah. Because I'm so itchy and hot. I'm just. Oh my god! I, can't even, I feel for you so much. <laughs> How have you coped? These, anything floaty, yeah, and just I got a yeah. paddling pool, and just that's just made it work. Yeah, yeah, you have to make it work. I think it's easier to dress up on this summer as well because, like, I haven't had to buy much return, just two pairs of jeans, and that was it. Yeah, everything else is just yeah, yeah. big. Summer or winter wardrobe? This is funny because I couldn't wait to get into my summer wardrobe. Now that summer's over, well, almost over, I'm already like jackets, jackets, jackets. Yeah. I'm so sick. Of summer stuff, but then you get so sick of winter stuff mm, by the end of winter. Yeah, so. yeah. And to be fair, it's all coming into the shops now, and you get all yeah. excited because it's something new. Like, yeah. you can't wait to wear boots and tights and knits yeah. and everything like that again, yeah. yeah. How would you describe your style, and has it changed since? I'd say my style is changing anyway. I just, every day, I decide something different to wear. Spencer described me the other day when he met me on the jump as this cool girl who was wearing trainers and tracksuits. So I could be wearing trainers yeah. in a tracksuit, yeah. or I could be in like a flow yeah. dress like this. That I could share it. I definitely mom. feel like you're quite sport. You've got a nice sporty vibe. Yeah. yeah. Like you do like I wear a lot of gym gear well. though. Yeah. I just I find it so comfortable. And I think gym gear now you can actually get over. Yeah. 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 And do you wear gym wear if you go to gym? Yes. Yeah. I wear it. Yeah. I wear it in the morning though, hoping at some point I'll go to the gym. You wait till you do the small run. You'll be good. Yeah. I'll be one of those. How do you think your style will change once you become a mummy? I'm hoping it won't change that much, but um, there seems to be a lot of talk of vomiting all over me all the time. <laughs> <laughs> and, and poo explosions, so I'm thinking I'll be wearing less white. I, uh, I think I'll be just wearing wearing easy clothes. I find these sort of things easy to wear, but yeah. gym gear is easy to wear. Like, yeah. I think that you can still keep your style and be a mum. Definitely. Oh, yeah, of course you can. Cool. You are definitely going to be a star. Yeah, star, I hope so. <laughs> Where's been good for you to shop in Tesla? I think for me, I haven't actually shopped from Tesla where I've had two pairs of jeans, that was it, that I've turned me up, so you can't afford that. Yeah. Now, everything else has been from my wardrobe because I have so many floaty dresses and everything is quite oversized anyway, so I've just yeah. stuck to that. That's why I think being pregnant with someone. It's a killer. It's so much easier to dress. Yeah. Like, you don't need as many layers. Oh, no, I just hate to put on a coat and everything like that. But um, I think places do do great maternity wear, but even with gym gear, everyone's like, going to get your maternity gym gear. I haven't changed and just gone up in sizes. Yeah. Although I will say, Lulu never did the most comfortable gym leggings for like a month. Yeah. I forget what I forget what they're called. They're so supported. Yeah. So good. Yeah. 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 I have a regret on my clothes coming. <laughs> all the time. <laughs> yeah, all the time they have. Uh, yeah, yeah, but yeah. it happens. Like, like, why did I wear that? Yeah, God, and you think you look so great when you've done it, and then you're like, oh my God, I just looked awful. Well, I say that gold dress you wear the other day. Oh my yeah. God, yeah. you look that. in you. I know, that, that was really good for a maternity yeah, as well. It was. Like, I just couldn't tie. 
Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So you looked just like beautiful. Yeah, yeah, really I nice. love that. That was a really good turn. Yeah, it's great. Sure, you're not too much. Golding it up. <laughs> what is your favourite house high street shop? Oh, favourite high street shop. You know what? I love H and M, but H and M you need to go to the right one because yeah, yeah, they yeah. have the best things in certain ones. They've got a certain section. I can't remember the name of it. Studio. Yeah. Oh studio. my I god. Love so much studio. So. Them, I love um, Marquette. Other Stories is amazing. Yeah. Um, that's not too shit, just done really well. Yeah, yeah. The the scene, like, yeah but that was like my mum's favourite job. Mm. I used to like, I'm not into it. But now I just now you're so so it. <laughs> yeah. It's so good. Uh, and then, um, what's it called? There's another one in Spain, I forget what it's called. But it's I'm sort of uh, falling out of love with Zara because I feel like if you get something really amazing there, millions of other people are going to have it, so it just comes more. We need fire. another one like Zara. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, I can't remember someone really can't remember that name. It'll come to you. Yeah. Who's your favourite designer? Ooh, favourite designer? Ooh. I love Celine. I love the simplicity of Celine and stuff, but Zimmerman have just been amazing. Like they, they weren't nearly as expensive as they are now when it's Australia. They are like crazy. Yeah, yeah. And it's stuff is just incredible. I love Zimmerman. I love uh, some of the markets where she always has been stuff. Um, getting a little bit over Gucci. I wouldn't. I don't know how Everyone's much. Doing it. Oh, yeah. Everyone's doing it. Yeah. So do, much copied stuff. Oh, so much. But I do have. Oh, I just like to do that. It's, I love the Gucci bag, and now I'm just thinking, where is that? The panic set. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I, I, I can't literally go and check out this. I thought I did, but a trainers were hanging. Trainers, trainers definitely. Yeah, so if you see me wearing heels, I probably have trainers in my car. Okay, I would never, ever say. Always going out with Yeah. I'm such a giant, though, anyway, that I, I feel. Um, I feel like I'm just yeah, and I feel huge. Yeah. Wearing all the time. I do wear them because they make your clothes. Yeah. Times yeah. Especially when you're dressed, but never for a full night. You can choose to be casual. Yeah. 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 Who is your celebrity style crush? Ooh, celebrity style crush. Uh, Kate Bosworth never gets it wrong. Diane Kruger always looks amazing. Uh, Olivia Palmero. Yeah. Oh my god, obsessed with I hate saying that because it's so it's, it's almost too. basic yeah. because everybody says her but she just looks she, amazing how much would you love to be her and everyone oh, want to be her she just looks effortless she just looks like, yeah. just her oh my god absolute dream, dream. Uh, and you know I love uh, Millie Mack I love her yeah. I love all of her whenever I see her she's just got the most yeah. amazing effort yeah. on ever I might say that one Yeah, her will be good. I might send her a text and be like, anything you throw out, <laughs> send it to Battersea. Would you say you are messy or organised? Definitely organised, but you guys sent me on this absolute rampage. That and being pregnant, honestly. My mum was like, you've got to stop doing something. I started tearing up the wardrobe, so the presses in the kitchen, and then my whole thing at home. And it was because we did that yeah, with my... Rolling. But the difference, even in changing and stuff like that like it just makes so, so how many clothes I can see that I have now that I never would have even yeah. known I had yeah. before you two came over so, section in it it's just yeah. so simple but you think oh I just had it all in the wrong places as well. Yeah. I remember I was like reaching up to the yeah, bras and yeah. everything like that. And now you're sort of holding your wardrobe in one wardrobe. Yeah, I yeah, absolutely. Yeah. It's, and it's all perfect. I like would let we you should, go. We should go and check. Yeah. <laughs> we trust you. What's the last item you purchased? Last item I purchased. Do you know what? I went shopping on Saturday when my friends were over and I was shopping for clothes in my size so I was buying like the eights and tens and just it was quite nice to do yeah. that. I was getting my friends to try them on but uh but I have started because like I yeah. missed out a whole season of buying anyway yeah. so I was like I want to just buy a few nice bits for yeah. for when I eventually lose all the yeah. yeah you are literally all fine <laughs> yeah there is just a baby in your yeah. 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 you'll be all well and down. you'll be fine. It's gonna be so weird not to have this because I still bang my tummy off the most of the time because I like, just forget it's yeah. there. Uh, and to be fair, you'll miss it. But I remember yeah. towards the end, you're like, oh, can't wait for it. To be, you know, yeah, it's a, definitely, especially in this heat. But then as soon as you've found box, yeah, you miss it. You're like, oh, you almost get like pretend box, like kicks, aren't you? Yeah. Like, it must yeah, feel I like a phantom kick. 
Like you still feel like I'm so used there. to the kicks though. It's just like at the start, I'd be like, oh, but like now yeah. you're just like. Have you, ever, have you seen the foot go? Oh my god, so How many. How freaky is that? Really, but like, but like they're just so squashed. That's why I'm there. Yeah, it's dropped a little bit. <laughs> I know it definitely has yeah. dropped. I, I, my doctor thinks by next week, so. I'm so excited! I know! <laughs> so awesome. You've recently launched a jewelry collab. What is your favourite piece? My favourite piece is probably these two that I'm wearing. Yeah. The, I have to change it because I've been wearing it for too long with the Celtic cross and the um, little horn. Yeah. Um, which I absolutely love. We're obsessed with it. I quite love everything in it though, and a lot of pieces have sold out. And actually, one piece that sold out was um, it was this Irish coin with the Mac of Ireland cut out. Oh, and I was really quite surprised shot. it was yeah. sold out because, like, obviously, like a lot of my followers are English, and yeah. like loads of my English friends have bought that one. And they just yeah, really, it's really so like pretty. That. I love the way yeah. you can layer yeah. it. Yeah, I see. I, I love, love having loads of jewelry. What piece of jewelry do you always wear apart from your wedding band? Which is yes. beautiful, and your stunning engagement ring. Uh, yeah, which I tack up with some gold <laughs> at my dad's wedding band, so that's his. Yeah. And that my sister has the other half. Oh, how nice is that? Yeah, it was actually left to me. <laughs> <laughs> but she had a she had meltdown, so we uh, cut it in half. But I think it's really nice that she has half. I know. Yeah, yeah. Like, it's nice. nice. Oh, how yeah. lovely is that? I know. So it always, it always just stays in my hand. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, love it. Yeah. And last but not least, any style tips for us? Style tips, I think always dress for your shape. I think when you just, well, I've even found that in my maternity dressing now. If I dress with something that's too tight, it just accentuates areas that just don't look good or as good as you want them to. So always just dress for your size and for your shape and you'll be on to a winner. Yeah. Well, you always look fabulous. Yeah, and you rock to maternity. Thank you so much for having us. Thank you. Thanks for coming over. <laughs> <laughs>